Here we go. Three, two, one. Oh! What up, Rep Pack? It's your boy here, King Reptar, back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day, and if you guys aren't, you know the drill camera. Look, it's about to get a whole lot brighter, Rep Pack, because your boy is here, and also another boy. <laughs> and Farkas here as well. And today, guys, I am going to be trying to show you guys something. I have been looking for one thing over the past year. You know what that is, Parker? A life. Ooh. Uh, besides, <laughs> besides that, I, still, I never can find that thing. Besides that, I have been looking for a bank window. The bank window? The bank window. Took me a long time, Rep Pack. But I have been looking for over a year now for like a high quality, ballistic, bulletproof bank window. Like I wanted one literally out of the bank, like straight out the damn wall, so we could test out how strong exactly are those bank windows. So today, we're gonna be testing out exactly how strong is a level two ballistics bullet proof bank window. I did not get that. I did get it. It's outside right Whoa, now. <laughs> do, you, do you mind telling me what bank you got this from? Because apparently they went out of business. I don't want to bank, I don't want to bank there. So I'm not going to say what bank it came from, but it was a local credit union that I guess wasn't getting enough uh, credit. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going outside right now. You are going to see it. They have not seen it yet, though. So they sell the shelves. They sell the employees too? <laughs> that's probably how they got closed in the first place. <laughs> yeah, yeah, slavery, that's not good. <laughs> okay, stop, stop. Okay, so stop, it stop is that. out here right now. Hammer time? <laughs> <laughs> yes, it'll be hammer time in a second though. So over here, this is the bank window. When you see this, the level of thickness, you're, damn it. <laughs> All right, here we go guys. Three, two, one. Finally, it's here. No way, that's. <laughs> An actual big window, dude. No way. <laughs> you cannot break this with your with every part of your being. This is show them the side right here. So Rep Pack, this is a bank window. This is level two ballistics. It was out of an abandoned credit union. Look at the level of thickness on this. That is a lot of thickness. That's thicker than your goddamn grandma. That's thick. <laughs> okay. So that is what we got right here. So as you guys can see inside of here right now, we got Mr. Jefferson Steelplex in there. And for the first time in his life, he's actually a little safe. <laughs> we hate you, Jeff. Even when I put him in there, I had to break his nose. <laughs> That's why he knew where he stood. <laughs> well, you know, you're not going to talk about that big wad of cash. Exactly. So as you might have just noticed, there is some money in here. Inside of here, I have over 10 grand inside that bag. But here's the challenge. Whoever can break in here and, so to speak, get the bag, will get the bag. So this is called the Bank Rob Challenge. So what the goal is here, you're walking <laughs> to the 1850s, you've got your revolver, you're like, put the money in the bag! And then they're like, no, we've got this. And then you've got to break that. Whoever can break this today will get the prize money. But I'm telling you this is gonna be ridiculous the guy told me this is level two ballistics there is no way anybody's getting through this so can my money's can we start now we can start whatever <laughs> but no, no. <laughs> so there are some rules though so the way we're gonna do it though is obviously we can't just start just bashing into it this is a competition so as you see on this table right here we have three different things we got kanai we got a tomahawk and we have ninja stars so that's gonna be kind of hard to break with it we've got three different categories we're gonna be using this video guys one projectile stuff like this stuff that is throwable Two, blunt impact stuff that just has a lot of just force where I went ahead to see if we can break into it. And then last, we have sharpness. And then if nothing can break in that, we're going to go into a fourth round, which is just where we're going to do whatever the hell we want mixed with some firepower. <laughs> so right here, we have King Reptar's crown. This came in in fan mail. Thank you guys so much. Looks like Neptune's crown. Yeah. Okay, man. <laughs> Bald. And now it's a ball. <laughs> You're gonna be putting all three of these inside of here, and this has one of the three weapons on there. Obviously, the worst one to get would be Ninja Star. <laughs> for you. <laughs> that, that's probably the most best for you because you can actually get the hit. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna all pick one out, and whatever item you get from here, that's what you have to use against it. And then we're gonna move on to the next round. So, first round, projectiles, all throwable weapons. Next round, we're gonna get a blunt impact. So, we're gonna go ahead and pick our cards. Go ahead, Matt. Oh, you can go first. Because he's not holding a camera. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so whatever Matt gets, I feel like you looked, but I didn't look. I'll do it again. <laughs> I'm gonna close these tight because somebody likes to be a fat damn I didn't snake. look. <laughs> damn. All right, so this is what Matt got. Let's see what we got here. <laughs> oh, come on. Are you joking me? <laughs> this is what happens. This is why I was like, why is Matt going first? Realistically, the best chance of getting through this is this tomahawk because, man, if you just boom, but the thing is, you have to throw it. This is projectiles. Yeah. <laughs> You probably should have hoped I got this because I could actually hit this. For happiness was a false prophecy. <laughs> oh, Jesus. That hurt. <laughs> All right, so now it's your turn, Park. Go ahead and pick well, one. Why out. do I get to go second? You have a chance. What are you <laughs> talking about? Why, why are you complaining? <laughs> this isn't the first pink slip you got. <laughs> you know, a car, right? That's for a car. Yeah, you have a car, don't you? Oh, okay. Well, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> are you. Are you 
these are ninjas. <laughs> these, these are your ninja things, though. These are sick. These are awesome. But the odds of them breaking that are very unlikely. Are you joking? Like, the odds <laughs> no. Of but by default, I got the kunai, which I really wanted the tomahawk, so Matt got the best item. But here we go. We have three different items. You got your, your ninja stars. <laughs> right here, I have my kunai. And then Matt has his tomahawk. So <laughs> we're going to try and see what kind of results we can get. All right, guys. So from here on out, it's going to be moving a little bit more fast-paced. This is the money in the bag challenge. Here we go. Parker's going to go first. He's got the ninja star. See if he can warm it up for us. Then I'm going to go, and then Matt's going to see how he can do anything with that tomahawk. I'm curious to find out. And then we're going to get straight into this. So who can get the money in the bag? Let's Me. find out. No. Me. Me. King Reptar! Matthew! It's not going to be Matt. Okay, let's go over here. Parker. What was that? <laughs> I have a theme song. It's about your house. It's not about you. It's, I have my house. <laughs> All right, so we're getting started. Parker's got his ninja star. What can we do? I like to make an animal draw. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what one ninja star would do if you were in a bank. Actual bank glass, what would a ninja star be capable of? All right, three, two, one, hit him. <laughs> Where did you? Oh. Hey, dude, not even gonna lie. That's not very much. <laughs> Oh, oh, nice, dude. You. <laughs> yeah, you heard me say that. I was like, damn, I only got like 18 tries left. <laughs> <laughs> so you got an actual little chip out of here. We'll let you rapid fire. I'll even give you that one back. You can rapid fire those last three, see what kind of damage you can All do. Right, let me drown in student debt, but won't give me a business loan. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Oh, it's a good thing you have that shield. I have nothing. <laughs> Let's see what kind of damage the ninja star. Okay, for what first off, you hit over here. So we got this little chip right here. It's not bad at all. That's pretty chipper. Yeah, and we got this right here. So it's safe to say Jeff is unaffected. <laughs> he's, 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 he's real scared though. All right, guys. So I got my kunai right here. He got some nice little chunks out of it. So my hope is I can get it too. I'm not holding anything back. I'm chucking it. I'm trying to get something to stick. First kunai. Three, two, one. Ooh. Did you see that dot? A piece of bulletproof glass. Dude, that is not bad for one throw. Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Ooh. Oh! One more. Three, right, that's four, two, but that's one. Fine. Oh! That was a solid one, dude. The reason we went projectiles first, guys, is I found online projectiles are actually one of the best things for breaking these kind of things. So I was like, let's get it started good here. But man, dude, I wasn't expecting that kind of damage. Yeah, I mean, it's a little small in comparison <laughs> to my damage, but yeah. <laughs> this looks like a lot of damage, but realistically, that's probably only like 20% into the glass. Now we're gonna go ahead and see what happens when Matt uses his tomahawk. You only get one throw because it's a big item. Alright, Matt's got the tomahawk. Let's see it. Alright, you got one solid throw, go for it. Three, two, one. Oh! All right, guys. So we got he got this much off. Oh, it's, it's right there. He broke the back of the handle, but you broke this piece off. The only sad part, Matt, is this thing really means nothing because we. <laughs> <laughs> even if you broke this completely, you still couldn't necessarily get in there. So <laughs> you got closer though. Yeah, like, honestly, you might be able to wedge in there a little bit. That's just straight up cheating. Rough off his hair. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, guys. So this is where we're at. Projectiles are done. We're moving on to round two, which is blunt impacts. All right, guys. So we have all the blunt items in there. There's only three yet. Again, so whatever you get, this is what you get. All right. Why does he get to go first? <laughs> just start that way. So we're just keep I'm maintaining it. <laughs> Let's Please. see what we got here. Oh, okay. So he got Lucille. Just I made of wood. I don't know. This might not be the best one. I, I was thinking. I was like, I don't know if that's good or bad. <laughs> all right, now Park Girl pick oh, his. Yeah. Oh, and then yeah. once, okay, there's only two in there. You don't have to do all that. There's so many options. <laughs> all right, let's see what we got here. Struggle here. <laughs> Bowling ball. <laughs> So Parker got the bowling ball. And the last item, let's see what we got here. This could be any of the ADHD's world oh. stuff. All right, let's see what we got here. Indian. Indian. <laughs> you have an Indian? Uh, yes! Uh, oh, <laughs> Some of you will get that real quick. <laughs> Damn it. So this is an Indian war club, guys. If you guys don't know what this is, this is probably the cream of the crop when it comes to impact. Three, two, one. Oh! Let's see what this thing can do. But oh, by first, the way, cold steel. Oh yeah, and it's made by cold steel. <laughs> All right, so Matt's gonna go first with that Wait. thing. All right, so Matt's going right now. I have my next level protection. <laughs> oh dang, is that Sterlite? Yeah, it is Sterlite. <laughs> Let's see what happens when you use a Lucille on it. All right, here we go. You got one hit. Three, two, one. 
Oh! That's nothing. <laughs> How'd that get sweat on it? That's my finger. Oh. It's always slimy. Oh. <laughs> That's gross. What happens to you? That's what happens to you digging the pink. <laughs> you should see my other finger. That one's brown. Oh. <laughs> All right, Matt. Show him the stinker. Three. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so if you had a baseball bat and you were bashing against the clerk's window, they'd be laughing. Go for it, Matt. They're laughing at you. Jeff laughing. Make Jeff shut up. Why is Jeff laughing? Would you like to make a withdrawal? More strength, please. <laughs> If you guys want to know what's happening right now, the science behind it, this is a wood baseball bat, so everything transfers. But the problem is, this is made to literally push things back. Wow. So with a bat, you're getting just straight shock on that handle. How are your hands doing? See, this one's shaking. My hands can do that too. See? <laughs> <laughs> hands are shaking. It's only going to be a benefit for you tonight. <laughs> I'm going to see because Matt's complaining a lot over here, so I'm going to see if he's getting it hard. All right, three, two, one. Oh! <laughs> yeah! Now Parker's turn with the bowling ball. Let's see how that works. All right, so now we got Jason Balmonte here. <laughs> we got bowling champion. Why does the ball say Nikki? You got this at Goodwill. <laughs> Damn, just put me on blast. Like, he's got the bowling ball. The goal is to break through it. I mean, you got the worst items. Let's we'll see what happens. <laughs> Three, two, one. Who do you think you are? I am. <laughs> oh! How did it dig? Not even. That's, that's what I call it. a gutter ball. <laughs> All right. Oh! All the local grandpas are cringing right now. <laughs> oh! Oh! Watch out! Oh! oh yeah. Damn, dude! Absolutely yeah, nothing. The surprising thing is that the actually the projectiles did more damage than the impact did for sure so far. All right, my turn, guys. It's the Indian Warhammer. You know the thing is, they're here competing for ten thousand dollars. I'm here competing to not lose ten thousand dollars. <laughs> All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh! oh. Ah! Oh. We have ears! Oh. No, 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 You're done! You are done. Dan, you are sweaty! Wow! Dude, it cracked it, though! Dude, you can't that, that cracked it! Wow, he's right, you can't really feel it. <laughs> it's like... <laughs> Take that from you, cheater. <laughs> I got Mr. Excited. Extra hit, extra extra life, one more hit, four see, hits. Sometimes in life, if you take that extra hit, you might get some results. <laughs> but you still can't get the money. Because <laughs> you cheated. <laughs> but now, we're moving on to the sharpness round, which based on what we've learned so far, seems like sharpness does a lot. I think the only reason that worked was exclusively because I hit the corner right here. Cold steel nipple. If it wasn't for the cold steel nipple, it would not have done anything. We are in the last round now. Let's see who can do it. There's a $10,000 on the line right now. It seems like it's just a crackle. Away, but who can do it? All right, guys. So the way this works is basically it's all based a blunt impact. So a bullet. That's why bullets aren't able to get through it. But that's why we're able to get so much damage with the sharpness as I said earlier. Now we're moving on to just pure sharpness. This is our best odds of getting through here. This is the sharpness round. And it's for you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I've been told I'm pretty sharp. Yeah, at least you're not the dolls still tool in the shed. I heard that before. <laughs> all right, here we go. Go for it, Matt. All right, let's see what oh, you got. Straight grab. Okay. Straight grab for it. All right. What was it? Yeah. Got... <laughs> that might as well say loser. Oh. <laughs> Alright, so Matt got probably the worst one, unfortunately, but we got the triad dagger. That's the one Matt's gonna go for. It's very sharp, so who knows? And you notice I used the hydro dip one, not my M48. <laughs> Alright, last options left, guys. Alright, katana and a spear. The spear is definitely the best option. That thing should go straight through it. I don't know, we'll find out. Alright, so now Parker's making his turn. Go for it. <laughs> Alright, what you got there? Alright, what'd you Oh yeah. <laughs> That's yeah. a good one. I'm excited because That's that means one. I got I got the spear. You I think I might be able to break this shit. But I know I'll be able to break that. <laughs> <laughs> I have to clean that up. Like a life. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Matt's got the dagger right now. Let's see what you can do. You got three strikes with it. Go for it. Three, two, one, hit. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Oh my god! Three, two, one, hit it. Oh! <laughs> that thing's done -zo. But you guys, you see the notices. This just literally shows what I'm talking about, the sharpness. So when he did the first one, we got this instant impact. But after it got dulled, this is a damage he did. Almost next to nothing because there was no sharpness. Sharpness is the key. All right, so Parker's going right now. He's got the katana. Let's see, can he get the $10,000? Here we go. Three, two, one, hit it. Oh! Oh! We got some chunks off. Oh my god. The sword. My $150 katana. Oh, right. This is your sword. That's like. 
just gone. That's, thank you for reminding me. <laughs> Can you imagine you're, you just bought a brand new car, you can't afford it. The repo guy shows up, he's like, you spent $20,000? I'm taking it right now, you know that, it's all gone. <laughs> I'm gonna give you a couple more hits because I think that thing has a good chance of making it loose for me. All right. <laughs> yeah, you, you always go in second, you never want to be the first guy. Oh, you do? Or never mind. We'll talk about that later. <laughs> Three, two, one, go for it. Ooh! Ooh! Just keep going! <laughs> What? Oh, you're what? done. You're done. Shut your mouth. You're done. No, I get. I get. Go for it. I don't even think even if you got that off, you could get that in there. I'm bulletproof. <laughs> and can't fit. Because <laughs> my hands are so big. They're so tiny. <laughs> you're lucky. It's so tight. All right. So it's my turn now. And I got the spear. And I, without a shadow of a doubt, think this is gonna be the item that does the most damage. We saw what happened with sharpness. We have pure sharpness and weight coming right at it. Let's Not do even this. a shadow. Because that's, that's a shadow. shadow of a doubt. Like no, no shadow. Really? You see any shadows? I just see fucking sunlight. Right here. <laughs> Don't point down there. That's a shadow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so here oh we go. Go in first. Spear throw. <laughs> you know, I've said that before. Something <laughs> terrible happened. <happens. laughs> here we go. Three, two, one. Oh! oh! Look at that crack. That's one throw. Pure crackage. Ooh. <laughs> Wait. There's a big piece of glass that popped out from the back. I'm so close to securing this money. Oh! The cracks are starting to feel line. Give me one more throw. Oh! oh! Yes! Yes! But can you get in? Come on! Wait, so Come on! Hey, I got a way. We can, we can split it. I'll tell you my way. This is my money! <laughs> this thick of bulletproof glass. Oh. My beer! This is that? ruining all my weapons! It's also ruining your bank account. Yes. At least you can, like, jab up a little bit. Yeah, at least you gotta smack him around a little bit. Quack! Jump. Oh, 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 you guys. Alright, now you sit there and you watch that goddamn money, you dirty Quack. Now, the last round, and with that kind of damage, I think whoever goes next is gonna do it. The next round is creative slash firepower. You can use absolutely anything to your disposal. I mean the air bow, I mean the reptar's roar, sledgehammer, anything you want, it's all fair game. Now we all get 15 minutes to think of a plan, come back, and we're gonna try it. All right, guys, so we figured it all out. We all took some time to come up with a plan. None of us knows each other's plans, except for Matthews, because his was very apparent. <laughs> all right, guys, that's Parker's turn. I have no clue what he's got planned. So let's see what he's got. All right, so you put it down. What's the plan here? Well, as you can see. Well, okay, I can see. I put it down. <laughs> I'm going to put the hammer down. The hammer? What hammer? The sledgehammer? I'll go get it. Okay. <laughs> you mean oh. the hammer? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> So what I'm assuming you're gonna do is you're gonna go head down on that. You would assume correctly. God damn. <laughs> Three, two, one, hit it. Oh! 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 oh my god! It split it all the way down the middle. Oh! You got one last hit. If you can't do it this hit, I get an opportunity. Oh! The hammer broke. Oh my god. Okay, let's see if Parker can manage to reach you. cannot lift it up. Okay, so he broke the container that was on the other side. So therefore, he could just reach in here. But honestly, I think it's pretty safe to say that no matter which way, I'm getting that bag. <laughs> I'm sad. <laughs> I will only say you can get into it, though, if you can manage to actually get your hand through. So go ahead and give it one more hit. I think that's all it's really going to take. Oh! Right. Oh. Three, two... One. Oh, okay. No, I can't see my money. It's right there. Oh, you need, oh, you need my money? <laughs> no. If you can't get it, you can't get it. If you can't get it from this, you're done. No, 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 no. <laughs> no. <laughs> that panel's movable. Oh. What the? No. Oh. Oh. Are you joking me? What the? My money. God damn it. What the? Don't do that with my goddamn money. What the? Damn. Remember Tech Dex? <laughs> God damn, dude! Look at look at this. I mean, how much are you for the damage? <laughs> <laughs> you realize I paid for this window. You broke my weapon, and you took my goddamn money. Okay. <laughs> All right, Rep. Yeah. Today, your boy Re King Reptar took the L, and we ended up losing. So did you? Shut the fuck up, guys. <laughs> I'm the real loser because I lost money. But I hope you guys enjoyed this one. It's all for your guys' entertainment. Check out this video right here. I'm sorry I sound no depressed. I'm just trying to figure out how to talk to my accountant tomorrow. <laughs> video out right here which is actually the last video of an unboxing we did which is area 51 mystery box there was all types of weird crazy in there including a flame
game knife, an actual knife made out of fire. So if you go check that video out over there, guys. I'll see you guys over there. And as always, Red Pack, I'll see you beautiful people in the next one. Adios. Bloop.